this video. This is T's Workbook Hints video number four, and we're going to look at translating a perimeter word problem. This example here will be helpful when working through the geometry section in the T's Math Workbook. The most current version of the workbook is version 1.3, and you can find a link to that workbook in the description of any of my T's videos. One more thing I'd like to point out here is that should you decide to purchase the workbook, it will be delivered electronically instantly after you purchase it. I was getting some questions on when will it be shipped. This is an electronic workbook and I chose to make it electronic for two reasons. One, shipping, and two, I can update this file whenever I want and whenever I update it, you'll get a new download link for the workbook. As a matter of fact, I expect to release another update to this workbook within the next month or so. But anyway, on to this problem. The length of a rectangular shaped garden is five feet more than twice the width. If the perimeter of the garden is 148 feet, find the dimensions of the garden. Now let's act like we don't have multiple choice here. Let's actually solve this algebraically. So we have a rectangular shaped garden. We have a length and we have a width. And what we know is that the length of this garden is five feet more than twice the width. The length of this garden is five feet more than twice the width. We are translating this right here to an algebraic expression. Five plus two W means five more than twice the width. So this is going to be our length and our width. Well, I'm just going to use a W for the width. And having these two pieces here are very beneficial because now what we're doing is we're finding the dimensions in terms of one variable. Instead of us having an L and a W in this problem, we're going to have just W's. So if this is 5 plus 2W, this will also be 5 plus 2W. And if this is W over here, you have a W over here. I'm going to take this stuff and slide it on over. And now let's talk about the perimeter. You can find the perimeter of any shape by adding up all of the sides. And a shortcut for the perimeter of a rectangle is you can take two times this because you're essentially adding this plus itself again. So a shortcut there is to take two times that length of five plus two W. So essentially I'm adding this one and this one when I'm doubling it. And over here on this side, we have a W here and a W here. So we have plus two W and this is going to be equal to our perimeter, 148 feet. Now, by all means, you could have just gone all the way around and added up everything. That will be totally fine when you combine like terms. I assure you, you'll get the same thing. But here I'm going to distribute 2 times 5 is 10. 2 times 2w is 4w. And let's bring down this 2w here, and we have an equation that we need to solve. Notice this equation has just a single variable in it, w. Combining like terms on the left-hand side, we have 10 plus 6w, that's the 4w plus the 2w there, is equal to 148. And now let's work on getting this w by itself. So I'm going to move the 10 over here, and I'm going to subtract 10 from both sides. That's going to cancel out the 10s over here. Bringing down what we have left, a positive 6w is equal to 138. So six times our width equals 138. I'm going to divide, that's the inverse operation of multiplication. Therefore, we have a single W over here and all we have to do now to find the width is to take 138 and divide it by six. When you divide that, you should get 23 and this is the width of the garden. Now we want to find the dimensions of the garden. So we have the width and the width is equal to, well, W right there, right? And we said W was 23 feet. To find the length of our garden, the length is going to be equal to the five plus two W. So five plus two W, if you plug in the 23, which is W, two times 23 is 46, 46 plus five is 51. These are the dimensions, 23 feet by 51 feet, and we can quickly check this. If I take the 51 plus the 23 plus the 51 plus another 23, I'm adding up all four sides of that rectangle. 
So I'm adding up the 51 twice, as you can see there and there, and then I'm adding up that 23 twice. And notice when we do that, we do get 148 for our perimeter. Not only that, I want to make sure when I take 5 plus 2w, that's going to be 5 plus 2 times 23. Notice we are satisfying that first sentence up here in our word problem. And that sentence is saying the length of 51, that is 5 feet more than twice the width. 5 feet more than twice the width of 23. So that works perfectly as well. And yeah, there you have it, translating a perimeter word problem, uh, using a little bit of algebra, some geometry, maybe a, a new approach to finding the perimeter of a rectangle, two times the length plus two times the width is the perimeter, or then again, you could simply add up all four sides. If you have any questions, leave a comment below, and that's it for this video. I hope it helped.